Fox Weather spotlights the stories of America's first responders in tonight's special war weather warriors, heroes on the front lines. Janice Dean, Fox meteorologist, joins us this morning with a preview. Good morning, Janice. Good morning. Good morning, Austin. Yeah, talk about uh, Team Rubicon. How were you introduced to the group? Uh, Hurricane Harvey five years ago hit uh, southeast Texas. Of course, you guys know the, the damage that it, it brought to southeast Texas and inland as well. I think close to 60 inches of rainfall, which was unprecedented. And I wanted to go down and see what was happening after the storm. You know, as forecasters, as meteorologists, we always tell people where the danger is moving in. But afterwards, it's the first responders, the people that go in after the storm is hit to try to help those, you know, in the greatest of need. And Team Rubicon is one of those organizations. It started uh, by Jake Wood, a former, you know, Marine who decided that he wanted to help other people after his service uh, with them. And this organization is near and dear to my heart because 70 percent of it, uh, it makes up uh, first responders and people in the Marines and the Air Force. So people who have done their duty uh, to this country and have retired and still want to serve. And that's why uh, this organization is so special, uh, because they do. They, they do the dirty work, the stuff that we don't typically see uh, going in and homes that have been inundated by floodwaters. You don't typically see what happens underneath the floorboards, the mold that they have to deal with. And they go into impoverished areas, people that can't afford a rebuild. So that's why it was important to shine a light on an organization like this. We also talk about a faith-based gr group uh, that believes that God is telling them that they need to help the less fortunate uh, people who have gone through storm destruction, not only hurricanes, but uh, tornadoes, even ice storms across the country. I grew up in Canada. I know what that's like. We had the National Guard come in uh, and, and help us because the power was out for weeks. So these are stories that we need to tell those who go into danger when others are fleeing. Yeah. And you also feature the Hegan brothers. Who's that? That's a family of firefighters, basically. Yes, absolutely. An important story to highlight because uh, this weekend is the 21st anniversary of 9-11. Gary Hegan started his duty as a firefighter on 9-11 21 years ago, and he was also affected by Hurricane Sandy, Superstorm Sandy that crashed into the Northeast almost 10 years ago. Uh, so he talks about not only his service, but being someone who, who needed help uh, after the storm hit. So they are incre it's an incredible family, three brothers that decided that they wanted to serve. Uh, and really, I think the common thread through this documentary is people helping people, strangers coming out uh, and helping those that really you know, need it uh, at, at the worst time in their lives. Definitely. Well, last question. We've got about a minute left. Uh, what was the experience like filming this special? What did, what did you learn personally? Mm, I loved it. You know, my husband's a firefighter. He's been with the department, the FDNY, for 27 years. So when Fox Weather came to me and said, what do you want to focus on? What are your passions? Well, weather is one of them. And first responders, uh, certainly, uh, they're very important to me as well. So we combined both of them. I hope you'll watch 10 p.m. tonight, Fox Weather. If you don't have the app, you know, the documentary is important, but your forecast is important, too. And, and I highly recommend it. It's the best app for weather out there. There you go, Janice Dean. Thank you so much. And like she mentioned there, to watch the full special, you could download the Fox Weather app and stream on your favorite connected TV device. Thank you. Janice, thank you so much. We'll be right back.